The 15-member bloc met this weekend to discuss matters affecting the region. All these leaders agreed to continue monitoring the political situation in the DRC. Sadek has also pledged to assist Lesotho as it heads to an early election in June. Elections in that country were brought forward following a motion of no confidence in the prime minister. The leaders also adopted an action plan on industrialization. Infrastructure development is at the top of the list. Infrastructure is one of the sectors that we believe we need to pay attention to because if the infrastructure is not there, you can't grow the economy. We have got to grow the economy and we are therefore identifying the specific areas that would need infrastructure. Uh, and, and of course, the very fact that we are a region that is working together, we need to have infrastructure to facilitate that intra-trade. A ministerial task force that was appointed to look into the economic integration in the SADC region presented its reports. And they put together a very good report, but which is still uh, needs to be uh, properly finalized. <clears throat> but we're happy with the report. Because firstly, the fact that we've all agreed, we have the same mind, and we would want to see trade uh, expanding among the countries of the region, etc. There's total agreement. So it's a question of uh, those who are working to put the plan completely at the end. But otherwise, uh, we, the progress has been made in that direction. The leaders agreed to defer to August a request by Burundi and Comoros to join the SADC family. South Africa will assume the chair of SADC later this year. Yodi Sanjamela for CGTN.